you are welcome to open therapy, open therapy of open psychology. We shall be looking at common obstacles to clear thinking. I am a biomedaramala, a clinical psychology. There are some factors that come in between ability of an individual to have clear thinking. One of it is feelings. Emotional feelings can come in between ability to think clearly. Cultural baggages. Cultural baggages can come in between ability to think clearly. Blind spots. Blind spots or bias or prejudice can come in between ability to think clearly. Now there are difficulty in people reflecting. There are cultural way of thinking which influence people individually and collectively. There are societal attitude. There are accepted cultural norms that people do not reflect on. There are social assumptions that can inhibit your ability to think clearly. Now, another thing is that people can fall prey to stereotypes. There is blind obedience and unquestioning authority. Now, one can have blind obedience and obey everything that comes from an authority figure without examining it. This can be a problem and inhibits your ability to think clearly. Now, habits of conforming. This can be a trap and it can be a blinder. And habits can be a blinder and it can be a trap. It can be a blinder to you seeing a better and good opportunity. It can also be hinder into your ability to see how to get out of stagnation. It can also limit your access to opportunities. So limited information can be an, a problem to be able to think clearly. Now an individual can have, will not be able to see a big picture of an if, event. So this can be an hindrance into your ability. So it's good to be able to seek other perspectives, to be able to look beyond the immediate and to be able to get filler from other information to be able to analyze. So skill sets that are of critical importance to somebody who wants to be a critical thinker. You have to be able to look at problems from different perspectives, looking at different perspectives, different points, and be able to sort out and weigh evidences. You should be able to weigh evidences. You should be able to examine assumptions, rethink basic assumptions, rethink basic assumptions. You also have to be open-minded to other ideas that are different from what you are used to, or new ideas that challenge long-held beliefs. You also have to be able to differentiate between facts and speculation. You have to be able to differentiate between facts and opinion. These are some of the skills that will help you to be able to go beyond those factors that inhibit you from being a clear thinker.